The question, what do medical professionals think of fibromyalgia in 2014? I am a naturopathic doctor, ND, and have fibromyalgia so I read the newly released research on this all the time. A lot has changed, it's becoming clear that fibromyalgia has a significant impact on the nervous system, this may account for why the symptoms are so varied. While fibro is currently classified as a rheumatic disorder, it may eventually be reclassified or additional classified as a neurological disorder, this has important implications for the development of treatments in the future. The identification of specific physical findings, neurological and vascular changes as well as chemical markers in the blood, means that the days of being told that it's all in your head should be coming to an end, that's the good news. For all that has changed, however, there is much that has not changed. There are still some who stubbornly cling to the idea that fibromyalgia is psychogenic or psychosomatic. There is still much to do in terms of raising awareness, for educating health professionals and researching the pathophysiology of this debilitating chronic condition. Check out the link below for a guide on long-term remission or to join in with the community.